fact, a wooden stick and would hurt you is a solid piece of wood. It's not a film stick and could hurt you. So there's still a lot of danger in the combat itself. Speaking of some of the other danger, what are some of the things to prevent us getting injured on stage? Yeah. Right? So when, when Daniel and I are going to do a fight, because we're fight partners, we've got it all choreographed, right, by our fight director. We never have a move in, in the uh, show that's not already pre-choreographed and completely thought of. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to have a low fighting stance. So this does two things. The first of all, it shows you guys that we've got a little bit of tension here and a fight might happen, right? Uh -huh. If I come at Daniel and I'm going like this with my fighting stance, it just looks kind of dumb. Oh, I mean, unless right? you guys are a fan of rock and soccer and roll. Right, and then, and then here we go, right? <laughs> <laughs> but the other thing it does is it keeps me safe. So if I was to stand up straight and Daniel was to push me, whoa, right? Oh, I have to move my feet in order to regain my balance. Now there's a lot happening on stage all at once, usually there's multiple fights going on, so I could travel into somebody else's fight and really get hurt. I could hurt them or I could hurt myself. So, the other thing it does, is we've got our nice low fighting stance, Daniel can push me as hard as he wants to, and all I do is kind of rock just a little bit, because I've got a nice grounded stance. Now the second thing, this is also really important, is we have eye contact. Now back in the 90s, people used to talk to each other and they used to look each other right in the eye, and that's what we're going to do here. <laughs> so, wait, wait, so we don't text? No, we're not going to, yeah, yeah, we're just going to look right at each other. Okay. <laughs> I don't know. Well, so, I don't know if I remember this. What we're going to do is, I'm going to have eye contact with my partner in this nice slow fighting stance. If I do not have eye contact with my partner, I will not begin the fight. Just because I don't know that he's ready, and I don't know that uh, uh, he's so not ready to receive my fist. So if our first choreographer move is a nice roundhouse to the head, what I don't want to do is come in, and he has no idea it's coming. <laughs> Isn't that beautiful marksmanship on this one?